Good morning, good morning. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Man, I didn't know this would be such a big, a big thing, man. I thought it would be pretty, pretty cut and dry. You know what I mean? Like the evidence is there. You can go to Tractor Supply website. Um, I mean, I'm not gonna show you on the phone or nothing, but just go to Tractor Supply website and look around for their mission statement, okay? And when you do that, you're gonna find the whole list of everything that they support and everything that they have going on. So I don't know, so you guys, somebody said that they called the store on a Sunday, <laughs> the, the corporate on a Sunday and talked to somebody. I mean, come on, you guys. Hopefully our group is smarter than that, right? There's no one in corporate on Sunday. Don't you, where you guys been from? You work? All the corporate people are at home. They got hourly employees and they're answering the phone. They don't know nothing. Most of them can't even tell you what row a dog chain's on. Okay? So I just want to let you guys know, like, I'm not just making stuff up. Okay? And I'm not anything else except worried about the kids. If you're an adult and you like to do stuff, you know, that's your, I, don't, I could care less, man. Honest to goodness. I have all kinds of friends. Gays, lesbians, right? LBGT, all that stuff. I could care less. I could have great conversations with them. We can laugh and hang out, right? I don't, I'm not judging them. But the minute you introduce kids into the fold, right? The back of my, uh, hair on the back of my neck stands up. And I'm not going for it, okay? And I'm not going to let anybody else try to slither and slather around if I see something right in my face, okay? And as a consumer, as an American, and as a Bible-believing person, right? I felt like it was a responsibility of mine, a, a, a call to you guys to just let you know what's going on at Tractor Supply. Now, you guys have to know all the other backstory, which I'm gonna give it to you right now, and then maybe this will help you to connect your dots, okay? There is a thing going on right now. It's called the ESG system. Okay, and you guys go look this stuff up. And remember I did a video a while ago about BlackRock. BlackRock owns all this stuff, them and a couple of other companies, and they're buying up all these companies' stocks. So BlackRock actually owns a large portion of this tractor supply. And whatever they tell them to do, they are going to do. Remember I told you that the train people were getting told that they had to cut diesel shipments back on their trains. And then several months later now, we're all running around talking about the diesel shortage. All right? All right. So I try to bring you guys totally legit information. And I did do some homework before I put that video up after I heard from Ted Nugent, okay? I went right to the company website. All you have to do is go to the company website, Tractor Supply, and just go to their mission statement stuff. And it just talks about it all in there. They're all in. Now I'm gonna give you a couple of emails. We had some of our subscribers reached out to Tractor Supply, okay? To Hal Lawton, he's the freaking CEO. Like he's in charge of running the stuff. And this is what Hal Lawton said. And then I'm gonna give you another email that's from Tractor Supply, okay? I don't make anything up, right? I take this stuff really serious. And for some of y'all, you're not, you know, you're not really tuned in to these type of videos. You just want to watch homesteading stuff. Get your head out of the sand, all right? Things are changing at a rapid pace while you're walking around with your, I don't know what it is, your high fluting, whatever it is, right? You're kind of like the people driving the Teslas, shaking your finger at people because we're on gas. Your car, that Tesla car is a hundred times dirtier for the environment, thousands than my gas car. So, I mean, you guys, in the, the comments and the emails that I'm getting, call, trying to call me out, you guys are something else. You guys, all I'm doing is bringing you the information. This is the last video I'm gonna do talking about it. When you stand for nothing, you're gonna fall for everything. I have people telling me that there was just some banner at an event that Tractor Supply had up and they'd had no idea and they went and took it down. That is a lie. It's a stone cold lie. Tractor Supply is funneling money into the LGBT community, which is no problem. And if they would have had an event that Tractor Supply sponsored, and it was just like, you know, they were just hanging out and having a barbecue or something, right? No one would even be talking about this stuff. 
but because they come out right and they're flapping their stuff and they're opening their shirts and they're taking dollar bills off of children this is a problem and if you don't see it as a problem unsubscribe right now right because I don't care if you subscribe here or not our whole mission here is to help bring you guys the truth help you get out of the system okay the system that's destroying our families now I got history on that I could tell you all about it about how they're targeting our families the white families the white middle-class families now they destroyed the black family Okay, they did that, man. Go do your homework. In the 50s and 60s, black folks were very prominent. They were doing the thing, right? They were well off more than most white folks. Go do your homework. Stop believing all this justice warrior lie stuff. <laughs> all right, I wrote Hal Lawton Tractor Supply CEO an email this morning. Here's what he said. He replied himself basically that we are, that it happened. And they are told by the organizers that it was to be family friendly, okay? So they said, we're going to put on this event, we're the LGBTQ TV, whatever group, okay? And it's going to be family friendly, okay? And he bought into it. And then they got there and they rolled out the dancing and the dollars and all this stuff. He shared, he said he shared our concern. Um, and he tells me that they were aware it was a drag queen story hour and now they're doing damage control. That's from the CEO, right, from his own mouth, okay? Just say you don't believe it, right? I'm just making it up, right? Our subscribers are just making it up. They say like, you know, when you're lied to so much and you believe it, like no amount of truth will set you straight, right? Just like this, the vaccine stuff. Like no amount of truth right now is gonna sway the people. And the, it's, the truth is everywhere. It's like the, the information is falling off the tables about it. And it's just deny, deny, deny. Now, this is from Tractor Supply's own website. Go look it up, okay? Tractor Supply earned a perfect score on the Human Rights Campaign Foundation 2022. Best Place to Work Corporate Equity Index and achieved its inaugural inclusion into the 2022 Bloomberg Gender Equality Index according to its own January 2022 press release. <laughs> now, Hal Lawton knows full well his company stands on ESG. Okay, now this ESG is what's going on behind the scenes. Okay, remember I told you these companies are making a pact and they're all getting together and they're signing up for the ESG. Okay, now you guys go do your homework. I can't spoon feed you everything, man, but I'm not going to come on this YouTube channel talking crap. I'm going to give it to you guys full board, man. The truth. Because the, the truth will set you free. All that other stuff did was just create more confusion. There's no truth in there. It creates more confusion and now people are more confused. I tried to give you the straight up stuff. I posted a, a picture last night on the community tab. And it's right here where the LGBT community is thanking them for sponsoring the Waco, Texas event. Do you understand that? All right. And in all seriousness, I've been as serious as I can be. I don't care what you do with the information. In my heart, I felt it was a valuable information for most of the people that watch my channel and Stacy's channel here, okay? Most of the people that watch our channel, okay, are tuned into what's going on. They wanna know how to get ahead of it. They wanna know how to beat it and defeat it. Okay, we're not all just here for rainbows and unicorns and just happy homesteading stuff, right? This country's changing, and if you enjoy your freedoms, okay, and if you enjoy your way of life, you better start participating. And that's all I got for you guys today. Go look this stuff up. They cannot hide it. They're putting it right in plain sight. And now you guys are squabbling amongst yourselves on rumors and innuendos and giving them more room to breathe. And that's the part I can't figure out. So trust me, don't trust me. Shop there, don't shop there. Subscribe here, don't subscribe here. <laughs> I don't care. But I'll be back for another video and hopefully you'll be here. All right? This is just this facts, man. There's so much going on out here and you guys are just, you know, focused in on your own little stuff. If we keep focused in on our own little stuff, this big stuff is going to put us in the trick bag. Right? That's how this stuff always operates. I didn't do nothing until they came for me.